I do, people. Howdy, howdy, howdy. <laughs> yeah. I think they upped my medication. My words, my opinion. I think I can say that. <laughs> uh, we'll see if YouTube takes this one down on me. All right, folks, look. You know what protects us when we say the dumbest things? First Amendment. You know, under free speech that's protected is stupid, stupid comments. Now, dangerous comments, not so much. In fact, some statements can actually be an arrestable offense. Okay. <clears throat> but we are afforded the protection to say stupid things under the First Amendment. These here United States of America in our Constitution. So, does that mean that the right is trying to crap on the First Amendment? All right, here's what I mean. Ben and Jerry's, yeah, they say stupid things. And actually, I don't know if it's Ben or Jerry or Ben and Jerry. It's a, who knows, it could be the company. I don't think so. I don't think the company's that. Okay, so then they want to cancel them. So they they don't want to, they say they don't want censorship, but they want to censor books. They want to pull books that they don't like. They don't want to talk about subjects and they don't want you to talk about subjects that, that they're afraid of because they're, they want to keep themselves ignorant, deliberate ignorance. Okay, but yeah, Ben and Jerry said something and under the protection of the First Amendment. So now the right's jumping all over them, and I'm sorry, they're getting upset because a person said something that actually makes sense, okay? It's, it's, they believe that the federal government should give Mount Rushmore back to the Lakota tribes. Well, Supreme Court ruled that the, that the land was taken egregiously from them. So I can understand making a comment by that, because basically the Supreme Court believed, said the same thing, not to give it back, but they said that, yeah, it's theirs. And But I'm just tired. The right doesn't know which way to turn. So they're trying to crap on the First Amendment. So, see, they're only against censorship if they get to control what gets censored. Okay? And that, I'm sorry, folks, that is like number one sign of a slide down an authoritarian belief. I'm telling you folks, folks, when you start censoring books and burning books, you know, Fahrenheit 451, okay, great movie. Okay, that shows one of the first steps towards an authoritarian belief. My words, my opinion. Subscribe, ring the bell, like, spread the word. Like I say, yeah, not all books belong in school and I don't support all books that are in school. But I leave it up to the educators to determine what is good for a child to learn in our education system. And if you don't like it, then you can take your child out of the education system. Have a good day, folks. I appreciate you.